Hello grade 1, today we're gonna talk about the first math lesson in the fourth quarter, lesson 9.1, order length, shortest and the longest. We can put object in order from the shortest to the longest or from the longest to the shortest. We can compare two objects like these two lines, yellow and red. The yellow line is shorter and the red line is longer. Shorter is the small one and the longer is larger or bigger one. When we are comparing between two objects, I have to put ER in the end of short and the long. But when we compare more than two objects, I have to put EST in the end of short and the long. Yellow, red, green. The yellow line is the shortest one. And the red line is longer than the yellow and the green line is longest one here we will draw a missing line shortest and longest I have these two lines the shortest one and the longest one we can draw the missing line anywhere in between the shortest and the longest in the middle and let's see it have to be longer than the shortest one so it must be here and shorter than the longest one so it must be till here I can draw it anywhere in this area so I can draw it here in the middle and draw my line that's the middle line clear great job We can draw three lines in order from the shortest to the longest. The shortest one, it has to be very small, so I can draw it like this. Then, the longest one, it has to be much bigger. And the middle one again, it must be in between them. Any area in between them. I can draw it till here. Good job, grade one. The last one. We can draw three lines in order from the longest to the shortest. Here we need to start from the longest one. I can draw it much bigger okay and the shortest one very small and the middle in between them I can draw it anywhere from here till there like this okay till here got it okay let's see our math book page 173 our math book lesson 9.1 page 173 173 the first one draw three pencils in order from the shortest to the longest shortest to the longest so the first one it must be very small I can draw it like this my small pins and the longest one it must be much bigger what about the middle one it have to be in the middle between them like this. good yes I'm sorry I'm not very good in the drawing <laughs> Number two, draw three markers in order from the longest to the shortest. I have to, yes, we will start from the longest one. So the longest one, it must be very long. I can draw it like this as a line. And the shortest one, it will be very small. What about the middle one? Yes, it will be in the middle in between them. Clear. Great job, grade one. The problem solving here is very easy. 
Fred has the shortest toothbrush in the bathroom. Circle which one of them for Fred? This one? No, it's the longest one. What about this? It's small, but it's longer than the shortest one. So the last one is the shortest one. That's my answer, so we will circle it. And now open your math book page 174. I have two questions. The first one is which line is the longest one? Which one of these is the longest one? And number two, which brush, which bent brush is the shortest one? Which one of these is the shortest one? Do not forget the longest one, it means bigger or larger one and shortest one it means the smallest one so think about them it will be homework you can do it alone and i will check it with you in the next time thank you bye